Today, I'm going to show you three great experiments using balloons. For the first, we're going to inflate a balloon and tie it off. Next, take a pin like this and place it on the table. Then take your balloon and see what happens when you put it on the pin. As expected, it pops straight away. Next, we're going to take a whole handful of pins and lay them out flat, like this. Then take another balloon and try doing the same thing again. This time you can push the balloon down onto the pins and it won't burst. This is because the pressure is now distributed over lots of pins. And the amount of pressure on each pin is too small to burst the balloon. I even found you can bounce a house brick on it. But do be careful not to push down too hard. For the next experiment, we're going to take some white vinegar and pour it into a plastic bottle, like this. Then take a balloon and a funnel and stretch the balloon over the end of the funnel. Next, we need some baking soda and we're going to put two tablespoons down the funnel into the balloon. When you're done, take the balloon off the funnel and stretch it over the top of the bottle, like this. Then lift the balloon up to empty the baking soda into the bottle. This starts an instant reaction which produces carbon dioxide and inflates the balloon. You may need to hold the balloon onto the bottle to stop it flying off. Pretty cool, huh? For the final experiment, we're going to take a candle and light it up. Then inflate another balloon and see what happens when you hold it over the flame. As expected, it pops straight away and actually blows out the candle. Next, take another balloon and this time we're going to fill it with water, like this. Tie a knot when you're done. Then take the balloon and try holding it above the candle again. You can see this time it doesn't pop and you can actually hold the balloon right down into the flame. The water inside the balloon keeps it cool so the balloon itself isn't actually affected by the flame. All that happens is the balloon gets black. Pretty cool, huh? I hope you've enjoyed watching this video. If you want to see more, including this really clever balloon on a skewer trick, you can click on the links on the right-hand side, or take a look at my YouTube channel page.